Good to have you with us. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner, as always, is Stuart Robson. And what we've got on the menu is potentially absorbing league action. It's Brighton and Hove Albion facing Manchester City. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface, and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. And so the match is underway. And a look at the lineup for Brighton. Well, although we have it down as a 4 5 1, it's actually more likely to be a 4 2 3 1. They play with two holding midfield players, a number 10, and two wingers. The system has a nice balance to it. And so they start at 11 for Manchester City. Well, it's a 4-5-1, but with three of the midfield players giving close support to the centre-forward, and the other two sit in deeper. Also watch out for the full-backs getting forward at every opportunity. They do like to get crosses into the box. Ball is loose! On well, a time for composure on the ball. And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. Just cutting off the supply. Sari. The fans imploring her to shoot. Oh, a tremendous block. Well, opting for the short corner. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Roared. Well, she's gliding through. Oh, that's splendid play. Closing down well. Spot on with that tackle. City free kick forthcoming. Well, the referee deciding that it didn't warrant a yellow card being handed out. Has eyes for goal! Well, the free kick taken, but saved easily by the keeper. Promising attack, this. And whipped into the box. Well, no danger now. Bad place to lose the ball. Well, the keeper is happy. The ball was there. In it goes. The opening goal in this contest. Well, here it is again. And the defending simply isn't good enough. They have to react quicker, deal with the danger, and show more urgency. None of which they did, and that's the result. Shaw. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Oh, fancy footwork. Well, whatever way you slice it, a long, long way from the target, Stuart. Well, a lack of technique and composure there, that's a bad miss. Khadija Shaw. Given away by City. Well, there is going to be stoppage time, but only the one minute. And that'll be offside.
And there it is, the half-time whistle. The first half action is over here on the south coast. Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in this second half. That's what you call defending from the front. Possibilities here. Well, how about that for a piece of tackling to break things up? And moving the ball forward with genuine purpose here. City know that wide area is really opening up. Crossing possibilities. Surely the equaliser. Oh my word, there's excellent timing for you. What a challenge. Thirty minutes to go then. She's made a really good intervention there. Bergsvan. Oh, that's a really good run. And it's opening up. No hiding from the fact that they really should have extended their lead. Well, that was a poor miss. Could they come to regret that? Roared. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. 20 minutes remaining. Pattinson. Sari. Determined defending. Can she find the right pass? She fancies it. Great defending. Pressing like that will help the cause. Poppy Pattinson. Well, on you go, says the referee. Advantage. And still looking to get the shot off. And a fantastic diving save. And a substitution in the offing. And the short option preferred. Well, another corner hot on the heels of the last one. Who can they pick out? And there she is with such an important save, and they're still alive. Yeah, she's produced a great save there, but are the team good enough to go and get that equaliser? I'm not sure they are. Well, the short corner routine. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. What about the stoppage time situation? Two minutes the word. Time is against Manchester City, but still they could hit back. They were playing fluent football, but then the foul, and now you would anticipate a yellow card. And following the infringement, a caution. Yeah, no surprise there. That was always going to be a booking. And there it is, the final whistle. The home fans are going to be happy with this result. Well, Derek, it was very competitive. Chances at both ends, but I feel they were the better team and they deserve their victory.